like to look here. They're all over my trousers. Clumsy, clumsy. I'll bring it up for you, Father dear. Why, thank you. You know, sometimes I think it's a mistake to have a dog for a nurse. George, we must keep Nana. I'll tell you why. Tonight, I saw a first little boy. He was trying to get in. Impossible. Go on to bed. The lot of you, Michael John Wendy. Remember what I told you, that boy. Oh, clumsy, clumsy hair, all over my trousers. Again. George, not so loud, the neighbors will hear you. Well, let the whole world know your place is in the yard. George, you must keep Nana. I'll tell you why. Have my master in this house, or is she? Come along, Nana. Oh, Father, please don't. She'll be a good dog.
topic, here it is. When the nurse is turning the other way. If they aren't claimed in seven days, they're sent far, far away to Neverland. I'm a captain. What fun I missed? Why did you come to all No Sweet Window? To hear all the lovely stories. Oh, Wendy, your mother was telling you such a lovely story. It was about the prince, and he couldn't find a lady who wore the glass slipper. Oh, I know that. That's Cinderella. He found her and they lived happily ever. I'm glad. Where are you going? To tell her the boys.
I've often noticed your strange dress crocodile. Not of crocodiles, but of that one crocodile. He liked me and I so much that he's followed me ever since. From land to land, from sea to sea. He followed the ship licking his lips for the rest of me. In a way, it's or a compliment. Well, I want no such compliments. That crocodile would have got me along if this book by some lucky chance he swallowed a clock. A clock? Oh, yeah, a clock. And it goes on tick, clock, tick within him. And so before he can reach me, I hear the tick and bolt. Someday the crocodile and then he'll get you. I, that's the fear that haunts me. Listen. They say that Peter Pan is away from home. I must think. Inspire me. Play, you dogs. What can you Captain? A tango. A tango. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> we have mother, let's we have mother. <laughs> Everybody, mm. children, I'm sure this cake is much too damp and rich for you. She's a lousy mother. She's a lousy viewer. <laughs> children, you must pay attention to your father. Peter, it is your responsibility to give our children their daily lessons like a good father. Very well, Mother. I'll do my best. I'll do my best! Are we ready for today's lesson? Yes, yes sir. sir! Then listen to your father. Repeat after me. Ha <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm trying to tiger Lily. The captain cut her bonds or plunge me hoping. Aye aye. <laughs> deal, deal, Peter's mistress, dinner again, Mabel Lake Day in the forest. <coughs> it was such a lovely dinner, limerang pie, strawberry shortcake, chocolate pudding, vanilla ice cream, and fudge for dessert. <laughs> yes, I always believe in a well-balanced diet. Now get the rest of the house and goes. Take a bowl of your own chingda. <laughs> no, really, Tink. I will not go home. Peter needs me. Why can't we talk this over like two similar human beings? Now that we're finished, tell us a story. <laughs> Very well. Yeah! <laughs> 
stay on the boat and have fun. <laughs> <laughs> what? Tuckalini has been defeated by pirates? Wendy and the boys have been captured? Come on, Team Let's say Wendy and the boys. Ha, ha, ha. I hope this is all mine. Proud of you, 
didn't just prepare to eat meat my food. Dark is this man. How about D? Pizza Pad, no words of mine could express me on your contempt. Ready, James? Ready. 